Hello and welcome back to Stranded Deep. You join us once again in the Cartographer with our 25 squares which represent the 25 islands that make up the entire world. Now, last time we edited uh, the Blue Hole map, we have edited Hobbs Rest. Now we brought these up to date with the current 0.48 update. There is one map, Deep Blue Sea, which we have, uh, which we've been using uh, in this session but it hasn't been updated and it's going to have some problems. So why don't we go in and have a look at it? Ah, uh, I think this was one of my favorite maps, definitely. So this has a few very, 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 very extremely obvious issues. First of all, uh, all the ficus trees got changed. So the ficus trees overhanging the little rivers that we put into this map very carefully, they are no longer overhanging. So we're going to need to sort that out. That's going to be a little bit of an issue. Let's move the camera up. Ah, what's also going to be an issue is the fact that the camera is going to want to rocket skywards very, very quickly. Now, um, there's going to be another problem in that there is a shark. Put in this map. Hey, buddy. Bloop. Oh, you are beautiful and terrifying. I don't know if you're even going to work. So, don't know. Um, we gonna have to tr uh, sort of test that out uh, for reference there are a load of boulders here right here kind of randomly placed why are they here why underneath this sea stack well uh, the question is very very well the answer is very very simple that that there is the point in which the shark gives up and tries to swim under the island or disappears or whatever. So when I said, hey, we put a shark, so in that little um, area there, in in the top of the map, he will get halfway round, which is about uh, where that sea stack is, and then he'll just try and swim into the island. The other problem with this map, and it's kind of an annoying problem, a very, very annoying problem, are these sea forts. They don't work. If I give this map to somebody else, there is a very good chance these sea forts will not render, so we're going to have to get rid of them. Sad, I know, but we uh, I want them to be here, but we can't have them. So first of all, let's get rid of these two. So we'll do that. I think the walkways stay, uh, from what I know, and then everything else disappears. So we're going to have to do something with this, and I believe we can. So we'll get rid of that, uh, making sure that is something we can get rid of. It is beautiful. Right. Um, what I might do is put some rocky rocks here. I think the rocks, uh, the stacks and uh, everything got a little bit of a, a, a facelift, so we can... Um, okay, let's, yeah, let's go head, head up rocks. And I think is going to be cliff two. Nice. Press T, make sure we are on the, the right thing. And what we'll do is we'll grab that and put that there. Nice, just making sure that is actually snugly in the rocks, good. Uh, then we could probably do something here with another another cliff. Cliff five, maybe? Um, maybe. Let's make a little uh, adventure playground. So cliff five is actually in the seabed. Uh, let us turn off the ocean. Yeah, so this is how close to the edge of the world everything was. It's, uh, it's a long way down. It's a long, 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 lonely, long way down. Uh, so what we'll do is press, press R, rotate that, because if we look underneath, <gasps> is it going to be open underneath? Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, they are open underneath. Ugh. Oh, oh, we'll just move it so it's just kind of slightly overhanging. Right, then we can do something with this. Um, let us move you a little bit more this way. Yeah, okay, I think that's fine. Uh, the camera's a little bit awkward. Well, the camera's always been awkward, but the camera's just being a little bit awkward. So we'll move that a little bit more horizontal. Okay, and I still want to make sure that actually just embeds itself in in the rocks itself. So we'll drop that down a little bit. Uh, it's obviously going to snap onto some rocks in the background. I've noticed that, and I'm not going to do anything about it. Yeah, I'm going to get a 
click away in a second. But uh, for the time being, we are going to drop another rock in and then we're going to rotate it around. So we'll hit R and then we'll hit uh, the green, green ring. Um, I'll tell you what, let us, let's move this this way. A bit that way. Uh-huh, 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 sure, sure. Um, I think you should be able to, whoops. Oh, I was just reaching for the control Z and unfortunately there's no undo. Every time you do something, it's done. You cannot not do it. Um, good. But yeah, I think you could probably get round. Well, you should be able to get round now. Mantle up, hop around and then up here, maybe. I think that'd be fine. That'd be fine. We can throw in a big rock, though, if we are worried about players not being able to jump up there by doing this. Popping that in there and seeing if that would help in any way. Possibly. Let's move that in. There we go. There we go. Uh, if we throw the ocean back on, so we can display the ocean. Boop. Cool. So the ocean is back on. We have some rocks. Uh, so what we've not done is put a walkway in at a, a diagonal. It's like, well, you want to get to the little island with the tree. You are going to need to um, to kind of figure it out. And there is a path up there, so that's cool. The other thing we can do is throw in some plant life. I think we should do that uh, just to make it a little bit more interesting because things out here should be interesting. You will have a reward for coming this way. So what we'll do is we'll get rid of this guy. Hey. Hey, how you doing? Uh, we'll just make sure we are on the right thing. Hit delete. And then find a nice uh, ficus. There we go. So this originally... Whoop, whoop, whoop. This originally was quite big. Um, and that's fine. We are, we are putting them straight into the rock. I think... I didn't uh, I didn't do this on the um, on the video when I made this island uh, but this was uh, that's camera so yeah if you if you haven't been watching this, this is your first time here uh, as the camera gets close to an object it slows down as you move further away it speeds up sometimes when you're um, strafing left and right so WSA and D uh, then you'll free yourself up from something's um, box and then you'll you'll just that's that's literally because we're, we're going if I do it a little bit further out it's literally because we're touching some of these branches it's annoying it's really really annoying um, I wish there was just a way of keeping the camera at a constant velocity a constant speed but it's uh, it's something to put on the wish list right okay so the ficus and the reason I'm looking around is because what I want what are we what are we jumping over now? One of the rocks, maybe? Uh, yeah, maybe. Um, uh, yeah, it's here. What's here? That? Nothing? Who knows? Um, so <laughs> what I was doing is I'm going to use a ficus tree. <sighs> and go this. Press R and rotate you in the opposite direction. And then probably have you... Oh, if you can hear anything in the background, it's because my neighbor's busy uh, building the Siegfried line out, Siegfried line out there. Um, I could elect not to record today, and then I was like, no, because people might want to see things being recorded. Uh, watch video, or there might be an airport going, you know what, uh, I'm thinking to cal cal my nerves, chill my nerves a little bit. Uh, I was thinking I would uh, like to listen to your, your tones. Good luck with your airplane travel, if uh, that is exactly what you're doing. Um, I mean, yeah, good luck. Uh, probably won't crash. Probably won't crash. Uh, no, safest form of travel, definitely. Have fun with um, that. Good. Ask the stewardess, stewardess, steward, whatever you call them these days, for um, peanuts. Uh, peanuts for the popping of the ears. Definitely a thing you should do. Or just go na 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 to uh, to clear your ears because otherwise, oof, that pressure difference is terrible. So I'm trying to click on this tree whilst talking ass, and it's, <laughs> hmm, I'm selecting everything but the tree. There we go. 
because uh, the bottom of it is not actually in the rock. Uh, what we're doing is we're deliberately... Every time you let go, it selects something else. What is it selected now? Uh, the rock underneath us. Who, who would have thought? I want to set tree. There we go. Tree has been selected. And, oh my god. Seriously. This is... This is terrible. And it, it selected literally C stack. Literally, literally, not figuratively, literally. Uh, so what we'll do is we will find another little ficusy bit and then have that there. And then we can, oh, I hope that's the right thing. Yeah, there we go. Rotate that around. And then rotate it around just to clear that walkway, maybe. There we go. Um, and the reason for that is you're walking along here. And oh, look, there's something growing out there. And it gives sort of an impression of stuff going on. But, 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 but it doesn't interfere with you as a player. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, we can also add stuff here as well. So let's do that. Uh, I, mean, I think the water's not too bad here we're going to have a look at the shoreline in a moment uh what we're going to do is add some yeah let's add a bush let's not add a bush we could add a little nana plant or something just for a little, little uh, decoration it's not a not a bad idea i don't think oh yeah, yeah you can put them on the walkways wouldn't be terrible okay cool so we've done that, and we'll just do a little rotate. There we go. So there's a little greenery, and we can just we can just kind of fudge it and say they are growing in the cracks, little bits of dirt here and there. Um, aloe vera. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure if this island has any sort of medicinal plants. Might be something for us to look at. So we'll do that. Um, rotate that round a little bit. There we go. So just a few plants on the way up. Don't need to go crazy or anything. So that's good. There's some plants over here. Ooh. Ooh, that acceleration. It ain't great. It ain't great. Let's throw something up here just to make it... Let's click on Torian objects just to make it so that you are not um, going to accidentally uh, move something while bringing things in. And let's give somebody... Uh, some of these love food rations. Yeah, maybe a uh, little little rationy thing. There is, I, f I seem to recall that there might be an issue with hitboxes and stuff on rocks rather than terrain. Because uh, if you drop it in certain places, it goes actually under the under the mesh and just vanishes. I've done this before on, on certain islands. So what I'm going to do is have it up in the air so that when people come here, uh, they may. Um, they may find the, the item that they're looking for. And it might not go under the rock. So we'll have it higher than it needs to be. Uh, we can always check that out. There we go. Let's leave that there. Okay, so a lantern and some food. It might just bounce off as a player enters the area. Uh, it shouldn't, but it's it's a little bit of a reward. A little reward for coming in. Um, so what, we, what do we have? Let's head up to terrain. Let's turn off the ocean. We have uh, kind of an old style beach. So the, the 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 sort of sand drops quite firmly into the sea. Um, it's not too bad. Could do with a little bit of extra smoothing. Probably been around before. But let's do it anyway. Let's crank that up and just smooth around. See what we can, see what we can get. Uh, it's going to be too, too bad anyway. Um, nice thing about editing an island rather than just making one from scratch is that most of the hard work's already been done. So you should have been in and just been like, you know what, you know what, I fixed most of the bugs. This is just coming back and just putting the, the cherry on the cake. So there are some areas where the train's not as smooth as it could be. Uh, around here, for example, along here. I think it was too bad here. Uh, I think it needs to be fairly, fairly steep along here, just because of the shark. Um, yeah, when I was playing with this initially, there was a question over whether... Let's crank that up and rip the knob off. Uh, there was a question over how steep you would want the 
uh, want the beach. Because there was also a question over whether a shark would swim into a shallow beach or whether it would swim into like a steep beach and just go and become land shark. And I think it just it just is a thing with uh, custom islands. It's just something you're going to have to put up with. Sorry, no answer, no answer until the shark AI is given another pass. So uh, we'll just touch the beach with the smoothing tool. Great. Um, there are actually quite a few things like wrecks and stuff already on the island. So we have, we have our shark. Uh, one of the things I did put in, and you can see how old this map is, is let's have objects. This guy here, the boy ball. Um, and that was an idea that was to say, hey, this is the shark spawn point. Unfortunately, because of the current system, it is completely redundant. So we're going to get rid of it. Rid of it. Speaking of redundant, let's go into here. So this is like a little building thing on the beach, but it's not. It is, in fact, <gasps> boom, boom. It's a boat. It's a boat. So yeah, there's quite a lot of boats. What are buildings on this island? Um, fairly straightforward. Player can't cross through the island mesh, uh, so the boat is there, and the superstructure becomes a little. A building so it's cool there is a wilson in here or wally or whatever we want to call it these here though uh i don't think we can select them select that one but these ones i don't believe we can select how close can we get uh very close hmm okay ah uh, there we go so we've got that one let's get rid of it goodbye uh we've got this one i can get rid of that because we have to be in the shelf to select it. You can't get these things outside of the shelf area unless it's on top. So that uh, was kind of an idea that, because I would be recording this island, throw a bunch of stuff in. Unfortunately, it didn't quite work that way. Um, it kind of fits in with the, this being a building and there being some um, rations and stuff kicking around, but no, let's so let's put some here. I don't think they'll get in the way of the loot box. Loot box. Um, ugh, the... Please calm yourself. Um, yeah, there's a container usually spawns there, which is why some of the stuff spawns on the floor, and which is also why there is a lamp in there because lamps are very useful especially if you're recording stuff for youtube or doing um the other thing twitch because light is good people see using light and if nobody can see what you're playing then you know well they're just watching you talk on a black screen um so what we have here is our river hmm good I'm trying to select this fike street it's going to be <sighs> please please, please. Please ficus. Please ficus. Oh ficus. Oh ficus. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. Ah yes. This old chestnut. So yeah, uh, one of the things about the trees here was that the trees were overhanging the uh overhanging the river. I think we could still do that. Not a problem. Of course they're gonna snap to any surface they find and if they go if they uh find the top of the cliffs they're going to rock and rotate around so what we're going to do is find them like this pop it in uh oh 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 there we go i think that'll do it that'll do it that'll do it right okay uh press t see if we can bring that back and then down a little bit so the idea was that they would overhang the waterway. I've got my fingers on the wrong buttons. Uh, overhang the waterway somewhat. Uh, there was one there, certainly. I think the some of them are fine. Some of these new fighters are fine the way they are. Uh, some will need to be moved over. So what we'll do is we'll rotate you over way, way, way more. So when you're looking down, uh, can we just see if there's a better way to look no nope 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 that's i think that's, that's as good as we're going to get it we can clone no 
we can clone you. We can clone you pressing C actually. Um, all right, and then R to rotate. So what we'll do is rotate you around. Of course, it's not going to be where we need it to be because of the game will put it slightly offset. So what we'll do is do this. Uh, bring you. Oh, ah, no, no. Oh, Ficus, can we? Can I? That's a rock. That's a rock. Uh, it's not a rock lobster, but it's definitely a rock. Okay, let's try and get this select. Oh, this this game's it's, it's a fun game. You should really try it. Um, let's get rid of this. All right, let's put a different ficus in. Uh, we'll stack one of the new ficuses with it. Uh, so let us do this. And hit, uh, w uh, one of the problems was the root structure was kind of poking out the ground, um, which is not so good. Um, so what we'll do is we'll do this and this. That's fine, I think. I'll rotate you around a little bit. Yep, okay, so that looks a bit better. It looks like everything's overhanging. Um, so at certain times of the day, that's going to cause a nice shadow across there. Uh, this is this is kind of open. I don't mind it being that open, actually. Uh, what about this way? Oh, that's fine. Um, we haven't been back to this island in a while. Ooh. This is uh, it's good fun. Right, okay, uh, let's get rid of this. This one here. That's not the, what that... That's not, not the one. I want this one. In fact, let's just move you over a little bit and then drop another ficus tree right on top of you. There we go. There we go. Uh, let's go select the tree again. Drop you right down until that, that first branch and then rotate you around. Uh, until you kind of fit in the area. Might want to bring you up a little bit. There we go. Uh, and that is just to add a little bit of shade to the end of this peninsula. Good. And then there's another feature. So we got this sort of bit of metal sticking out of the ground. What's under the ground? Well, it is another shipwreck. So this, this island was mostly using different shipwrecks. So here's one shipwreck, here's another. So there's two shipwrecks to make the ribs of this boat. And then just uh, one on the end um, to give you like a suggestion of a larger sunken vessel. Uh, yeah, so this, I think the theme for this was like, it would be like a research island or something. Ooh, this little pond here. Do we have problems with this last time? Don't know, let's change the size down and smooth this out. That's better. Just smooth it out completely. It's uh, infinitely better. Yeah, get rid of those bubbles. So now it's joined to the world and I think Tide will actually uh, cut it off and turn into a little rock pool. So yeah, Tide is a, a thing now. Oh, hello, bubbles. I didn't see you there. So there's bubbles along here, which is going to suggest that this will be very much uh, open. I don't know if there's too much we can do with that or that we want to do with that. So let's throw in something. Let's just cheat. I am very, 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 very uh, eager to cheat where we can. So let's do that. Um, we'll just throw a rock in there and then bring it back. There we go. A gap in the mesh has been fixed. We look away from there. I don't think I've ever run through that section anyway, so it's not really an issue. Uh, there's plenty of clay. Nice. Ficus, hello. Uh, that would have disappeared in the last update. I think there's quite a lot of ficus on the island. Uh, there is like a main wooded section. I think we should probably throw some more down. Only because, uh, only because the ficus -y ficus is now required for, uh, for, 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 for water. So we'll do that. We will do that. Ficus, where are you? Young palm. No. Why am I saying ficus? It's yucca. I, I'm literally... Looking at one thing and saying another thing. Don't 
don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, I do know what I'm doing, but I don't know what I'm doing. But I do. Uh, we also need to sort these bushes out. Oh yeah, I forgot the bushes had taken over the island. Let's get them sorted first. Because we can't see a freaking thing. Let's get rid of that one. Uh, let us get rid of that one. Let's get rid of that one. Yep. And let us get rid of this one. Have I seriously not been back to this island since they added these bushes? I don't think I have. I don't think I have. I can't remember if we... Oh, we have been here since the water update. I do know that. Because I remember being on this island being like... Hey, no, the water update's been a pain in my butt, no? Um, I'm, well, I'm hoping that's the, the bush. Oh, it is. Good. Um, do we throw any bushes over here? Maybe not. No, any more bushes. Any more bushes, any more bushes. In the old iron. I think there's actually quite a few, just sort of eyeballing it, there's quite a few yucca plants, but we're going to add another one. We'll add a few more. We can be generous with yucca. I, I don't actually mind um, just because of the way that it's been used uh now and if you want to make anything you're gonna to need to you're gonna to need to get that yucks um for the ropes and the waters which is crazy it's still crazy uh our bridges yep they work they still quite well they work quite well um i do like this sort of three-way river system running through it and that's really really good uh this is gonna be a problem as well so this bloop, this is something we added to kind of suggest that people may have escaped the island or came to the island or something happened on this island. So that will now disappear. Now I'm happy just to have that there and it'll just settle when uh, people come over here. This should be a... Uh, no, 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 no. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. Uh, this should be a big old ficus. Big ficus. Size of the ficus should be big. Uh, let us do this. So find... Find uh, Mr. Ficus. Hey, hello. Oh, what are you doing? Being a tree, no? Good. And I want that. I really do want it to be over the island. Uh, yes, that's exactly what I want. But I'm going to drop another one right there. And I want you to be kind of leaning out this way. Drop me down a little bit. So we have a world tree there. Is that going to look weird? I mean, it's going to look any more weird than anything else that we have done so far. I think maybe, maybe, maybe not. Yeah, it's got it's a weird sort of mirror thing going on there. Not happy with that. No, I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy with it at all. So let's get rid of that and let us grab a smaller ficus and just kind of let's manually do this. So let's do that. Press T, move you back, and then we'll do another one here. So we'll press uh, R. Hmm, that looks suspiciously. Oh no, that is right. Press R, press T. And move you in using the red and the blue toggles. Oh no! You, you sticky sticks are all sticking together. <sighs> Can I... Uh, it's not until you move the camera and you realise just how far away the thing you've actually selected is. Let's rotate you around so you're not looking exactly like anything else. So we now have a slightly more voluminous tree. It does exactly what it needs to do. It is over the island. Um, I think I'll move you a little bit more inland. Just because when you settle, you're going to settle straight onto... I'd rather you settle onto the sand. Oh, yeah. A physics object touching a non-physics object is going to have a problem uh, when a player spawns in or comes to the island for the first time. So it might just flick off into the distance. So we added more yuccas. Uh, we've changed some of the ficuses. We've got rid of the sea forts because the sea forts are bugged. Yes, you might be able to see them if you are testing the map, but as soon as you give the map to somebody else, uh, it will probably disappear. Um, let's add 
just another one of these. Boom, boom, boom. Yes, booming is happening. Uh, good, I don't think it looks too bad. We have another one here. Huh. Hello. Uh, just do a little rotate. So Mr. Pigs is there. I think there's a snake somewhere here as well. I mean, that's a stick, obviously. I can't remember where the snake went. That was a pain in my butt. It kept being a pain in my butt. Oh, stuck the camera into the ficus. Um, shipwrecks. Ooh, bubbles. Bubbles are a bad sign. Yes. Okay. Uh, we'll help train. We'll help smooth. Size good. And just smooth that off a little bit. Might help with the mesh. Might not, but it might. Um, so we'll do that. It's going to reduce the width a little bit. There we go. Don't know if that's going to pop away or pop in, or I, I don't know. The stuff that's actually in the wreck is not too, too bad. Uh, there we go. Good. Uh, you got a bit of clay. I think there's quite a few bits of clay on this island. Let's just check the river. Yeah, them bubbles is showing up, yo. There's much we can do about that, unfortunately, just because of the steepness of the um, size of the river. Uh, there is a wreck in a cave. We have. Let's check this, make sure that everything is okay still here. Let's head up objects. So, uh, we have a bit of metal work here. We have some oil drums. Uh, bits and pieces, and then we have the butt end of our cave rack with a suggestion that at some point in the maybe distant past, this was connected to the sea. Um, we have another rack here which is slammed up against the island. Uh, you can go up and then you can drop down to get onto the rack if you want to avoid the shark, but then you have to swim back to the shore. Because that was the way it was designed. Ah, you want to avoid the shark. Yes, yes, we all want to avoid the shark. Uh, objects. So, let's see if we can select... And let's not select ficus. You know what? Let's not select the ficus. I don't care about that ficus. We're going to leave it there as a thing that's being left. Okay. There's T. I think the trans... Is it the transform? No, no. I was wondering if there was like a specific thing that caused uh, caused you to kind of let go and then um, select some rando thing, but I don't think there is. Uh, the purpose of this this island is is literally to uh, get you onto the. Huh. Interesting. It stops rendering the. Te you probably can't even see that. There's a lantern on there. It stops rendering the texture after a while and it goes to pink. Like a, I'm guessing that's like a checkerboard pink. Uh, there's nothing in here, so this is literally just here for the loot. So that's fine. And then you can hop over the edge, swim back to the island, and hopefully the shark doesn't bite you on the butt. Because that is a great white. Still there, buddy? Still chilling? Like a villain. Yes, you are. Yeah, he's okay. Um... Yeah, these, these walkways were... It's kind of from the film Deep Blue Sea with the walkways and the chain link fence and stuff. Obviously, you can't put the sharks into a cage because they will swim out. Uh, they do not like it if you try and box them in places. And you can't put shark in a corner. So that's the thing. Uh, so we have come back. We have got rid of those. Um... Sea forts because they ain't gonna work. We've smoothed a bunch of stuff off. We've put some more yucca, not ficus, but we also have changed a few of the ficuses around. So we've got some uh, trees hanging over the edge. Some of these are okay, I think. Um, probably do something with this. Let's do something with this. Let's just add another. Nope, not that one. Probably. Hello. 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 Uh, let's move you in and see if we can just give you a little rotate. And can we select your origin the original ficus? Uh you know what? 
I'm not even going to bother. I'm not even try because I don't think that's a thing we can do. Um, let's do that. Let's press T and just move you in there. And then maybe rotate it a little bit. So rotate you out. Uh, and then like that. Okay, right. That, that does exactly what we need it to do, which is, uh, and again, just kind of over the water. If you're swimming down in the water, bloop, 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 bloop. You've got something to swim underneath. That's, that's literally all it was there for. Um, some of the river entrances have these rocks around them, so you can hop, skip, and jump over the water, uh, especially at night, although it's a little tricky, and sometimes you still end up in the water anyway. The water in the inland side of the island is mostly there too, well, for interest, but also you can keep cool by swimming around. Neat. I think that's, that's a lot of stuff. That's pretty much everything. Um, I think I'm going to leave some of these newer ficus trees just kicking around. Uh, that one... Huh. Did we change that one? Or was that... I don't know. Was that already ficus tree 2? Ooh, questions. I'm not entirely sure. I'm guessing if you had ficus tree 2, then the new, uh, the new cool ficus is now part of your uh your, your your island huh who knows this was always a nice place to start uh a recording you can stand here and just be like hello and welcome and just look back towards the island cool um yeah so i think that's pretty much everything i need to do on this island um with the downloads you can obviously download these in the video description and i will be uh updating the the downloads as uh, the islands get updated. So Hobbs Rest, uh, which is the home island, that's already been done. And if you download it again from using the same link, uh, it will be an updated version. And if you download the Blue Hole map, that's also updated. And Deeply Sea, I will be doing the same thing too. So if you like these videos, uh, definitely leave a little like, leave a subscribe. And if you do subscribe, click the little bell because you know what? that will give you notifications when videos go live and i think we're done here so i'm gonna say i'll catch you next time <laughs>